We can either go in the positive road or we can go the negative road. We either get bitter or we get better. And that's how the foundation program will be formed. So we go around to schools and we talk about resilience, uh, mentoring, self-belief and life balance. But really when you think about it, success is defined by overcoming your setback. Our greatest growth occurs when we're confronted with adversity. The aim is to design and build a paper aeroplane to achieve maximum distance and accuracy. So you come up on stage, off a little bit of pressure on you, and you have to throw the aeroplane as far as you can through the door. What happens is when people are under pressure, we lose collaboration. You need to surround yourself with people who believe in you and have, who, who are wonderful mentors. The people who bring you down, you need to move away from them. Find your passion, because that's what's going to give you motivation. And we say this to them, it's right. Anything that you do, that compromises you from getting to your critical success, you have to think about the decision you're going to make. In your behaviour, from what you eat, how you train, how you, what do you do? Is it moving you to that critical success or is it moving you away? Because you really control your own destiny. If you think of the final outcome, it becomes too onerous, too arduous. You've got to enjoy it. Because when you get there and you achieve, we need to enjoy the journey and that keeps you motivated and keeps you fresh. I want to put someone on the spot here because um, Jordan Stanley's next student here and as you would have seen in the video we have a, a, an offset to Nick Foundation, it's called Nick Foundation Players Group. Go to theatre, I'm not getting out of the stage, I'm not reading out of that. And ended up seriously falling in love with it. Impacted my life massively, and uh, as I said, I'd be happy to do it again. But the main reason was it was just something out of my comfort zone. I just thought, why not? I've got nothing to lose, and plenty to gain. And I gained more than I could imagine. It's saying that, that the difference between winning and losing is six inches. Did you get We must draw upon previous times that has been challenging on us, that gives us confidence and self-belief. And that is what gives you resilience.